With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so the question is, the side of a glass aquarium is 1 meter high and 2 meter long. When aquarium is filled to the top with water, what is the total force against the side wall? So let's see the solution. So according to question, it is given that we have an glass aquarium. So let's suppose this is the glass aquarium like this, okay, which is filled by the water with to the top, okay, like this, okay. Now the height of the aquarium is 1 meter and the length of aquarium is 2 meter means like this height 1 meter and it is 2 meter long so here according to question we have find the force which is exerted by this water on the wall of this aquarium okay so for that let's suppose the small portion of the aquarium as d of y means we consider a strip at a distance of y from the top whose length will be very small that is dy and we will try to find the force for this small strip because we know that as this is small the constant for this small portion will be constant right and then if we integrate it so that we get the net force on the wall okay because we know for whole complete wall the pressure is varying right so first of all let's try to find the force for these small portions which can be given by the formula that is a small force df will be equals to the pressure p into y into small area that is d of a so this will be the pressure onto this small portion will be y into rho g okay into area will be 2 into dy this will be equals to dA. But according to question, we have find here the net force. Okay, so the net force will be equals to integral of this small force dA that is equals to 0 to 1 y rho g to dy. Okay, so this will become 2 rho g integral of 0 to 1 y dy why here uh, we have taken this one because height of the uh, aquarium is 1 meter right so after taking the integral this will become 2 rho g in bracket y square divided by 2 0 to 1 so after putting the limits uh, this will become 1 by 2 so 2 2 will get cancelled we simply get rho into g so this will be equal to now the value of density is 1000 multiply by g is 9.8 so this will become 9.8 into 10 raised to 3 newton and this will be the required answer that is the net force because of water on the wall of aquarium will be 9.8 10 to 3 newton so according to option option second will become correct answer so this is the required solution thank you for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.